Good day. This is Maria Shanghai Nara from ABM 3A. This video presentation is knowing all about the topic of gawad ng manlilikha ng bayan or gamaba. Now, let's define gamaba. Gamaba is short term for gawad sa manlilikha ng bayan or the National Living Treasures Award. It is a person or group of artists awarded by the government of the Philippines for their contribution to the country in tangible cultural heritage. Ang gamaba ay pinagkakaloob sa mga individual o pangkat na nagpangalan sa antas ng teknikal at artistikong kahusayan sa sining ng Pilipinas. Ang madalas na nakakakuha ng award na ito ay ang mga katutubong Pilipino na matagal nang naumuhay sa mundo at nagpapatuloy ng kanilang nakasanayan tradisyon bilang mamamaya ng tribo o nasasakupan. Public Act 7355 Gamma by is a project of Philippine Rotary Club, Makati Ayala. In April 1992, the Gawad sa Manilikha ng Bayad Award was institutionalized through Public Act No. 7355, administered by the National Commission for Culture and Arts, or NCCA. Sa pumagitan ng batas, ang Gawad sa Manilikha ng Bayad ay halos sa National Folk Artists Award na iginawad ng Rotary Club, Makati Ayala. Ang pagpili ng manilikha ng bayan ay pinatutupad ng National Commission for Cultural Arts. Ang pangunahing tagapag-unay sa lahat ng ahensyang pangkultura at pangsining na bansa. Some qualification to become a national living treasure, the candidate must possess the following. First, an inhabitant of a traditional cultural community anywhere in the Philippines that has preserved indigenous customs, beliefs, rituals, and traditions. Isa sa mga kwalipakasyon upang ikaw ay mapangaralan ng gama ba ay ang pagiging miyembro ng isang pangkat etik. Sapagkat sila ang nagpatunay at bumubuhay sa kanilang tradisyon at kanuniwala. Ang salitang preserve ay may definisyon na hindi lamang inaaral ang kulturang kanilang kinilala mula nang sila'y isilang sa mundo, hindi ito ay dapat rin isinasagawa upang maka-influensya sa kapwa pangkat nang sa ganun ay naipaman sa susunod na henerasyon ang tradisyong meron sa kanilang pangkat. Another qualification who must have engaged in a folk art tradition that has been in existence and documented in for at least 50 years. Qualification naman na ito ay nagpapatunay ng karaniwang ginagawa na ng parangal na gama ba ay may mga edad na. Ngunit hindi pa rin nagsasawang gawin ang kanilang tungkulin para may reserva ang kulturang meron sila. A gama ba awardee must have consistently performed or produced over a significant period in which one should possess a mastery of tools and materials needed by the art must have an established reputation in the art as master and maker of works with extraordinary technical quality. Ang pagkakaroon ng natatangin skills kagaya ng nasabi sa qualification ay nakakamangha, lalo na't ito ay maaaring ituro at ipamana sa susunod pang mga henerasyon. Ang lahat ng damanggit ay ilan lamang sa mga qualification upang ikaw ay maging gamang ba-award.
video that's been played earlier, you are able to see the Gama Ba Awardees coming from different places in the Philippines. In every awardees, they have differences as well which I'll be discussing. 1993, Samaon Sulaiman is one of the person who been awarded for being a Kutyapi master and teacher of this instrument. Also proficient playing the Kulindang, Gandingan, Agong, and Apalendang, and Tambul. Sino Intara is another artist awarded during 1993 for being a prolific and preeminent epic chanter and storyteller. He is a recognized mastery in playing various traditional instruments such as basal, kulilal, and bagit. Ginaw Bilog is a Hanuno Omangyan poet who was awarded in the same year 1993 for being a master of the Ambahan poetry. In 1998, Salintan Monon at Tagabanwa Bagobo traditional weaver was awarded for a woven fabric using distinct abaca fabric called inabal. Langdulay awarded during 1998 as a tibuli traditional weaver of tinalak or also known as cloth made out of colorful abaca fabrics. Huang Ahadas is a Yakan musician who was awarded during the year 2000 for his mastery on the Quintangan, Kayu, and Tuntungan instrument. An epic chanter from Kalinog Iloilo, Federic Caballero has been awarded during year 2000 for his documentation of the oral literature, particularly the epics of his people. Alonso Saklag was awarded for the year 2000 in being a Kalinga master of the dance and the performing arts. Haja Amina Api, a master mat weaver among the Sama indigenous community, has been an awardee in the year 2005. In the same year 2005, Eduardo Matuk was been awarded for dedicating his life to creating religious and non-religious art in silver, bronze, and wood. Darhata Sawabi at Tausug Weaver was been awarded in year 2005 Pishabit, the traditional cloth tapestry worn as a head cover. Tafilo Garcia at Tabungo or Gord Cast Maker is one of the awardees last 2012. In the same year 2012, a master in Abel Weaver from the Ilocos region, Magdalena Gamayo was awarded for Gamaba. Thank you for your time in listening to this video. I hope you're doing fine and well. Have a great day ahead.